means time management the world itself is telling us what is it so time means uh, any period of, uh, of time for example uh, time can be past time can be future and time can be present so this is, is a basic tenses of time so basically time is the the clock that it takes uh, that uh, the scientists uh, made that the ancient greeks uh, times so, uh, time has been made so basically time is this and management means managing one managing anything you can manage uh, there are many things in management uh, you can manage anything is called management to manage anything is called time management so uh, time management means managing one's time so basically oh, i will be telling you the different ways of managing one's time so the basic different ways of managing your time is are two number one they are basically two but uh, you can adapt the third one also the number one uh, way is uh, create a calendar so creating one's calendar is uh, really best I, in my way in my thinking and my way that is the best uh, time management skill you can have so to create any calendar you need just to you need can you can create a calendar on your copy you can create a calendar on your diary or a pad this is a physical way of creating calendar virtually you can also create a calendar by going to google uh, google calendar and there are many more softwares and and excel and sheets and many other things you can do to create a calendar so basically there are many ways of creating calendar so the main purpose of creating calendar is to um, manage your time in google, google calendar in your google account there is a google calendar that is free and it is most cap, uh, suitable in my perspective because it allows you to create a you it allows you to create anything with more specific details and uh, like uh, in google calendar you can mention your date and time you can mention your, um, your months uh, you can mention each and everything that is a lot that is a lot of uh, you can say difficult in excel but uh, excel can also work so the one way is uh, has been done that is called um, creating a calendar number second way is to write down uh, tasks so google task manager you can do virtually google task manager and there are some other softwares and um, uh, websites also i will i will mention them down below so basically the main thing are the, these two things number one creating a calendar number two uh, writing each and every task uh, on the paper or on the virtually on google task manager the third way which you can do is to uh, install a software or you can say you can get a software you can get a license software as well as uh, we go through uh, open source software don't get the asylum that right right and this the second software type uh, that is there are two types of software that one is license the one is free go, go, go from open source because most people go to do that so software some people go to that's software so uh, you use a software that tracks your your time and your activities on computer but that's uh, limited to computer so that's why i mentioned the most two common methods that i usually know and i adapt uh, these methods in my daily life also so this is the end of my video i will be seeing you soon